Welcome to my video. Today I'll be talking about rabbit's behavior, problem of the behavior, and handling method. For my personal thoughts regarding this subject, it is very crucial for vet students as I believe it is essential for us to gain both knowledge and relevant experience. However, due to the pandemic, industrial training experience is no longer applicable right now and it is exchanged with a video assignment. To be honest, this assignment helped us to understand the animal's behavior and how to handle them with care in order to minimize the incidence of injury to ourselves and the animals. For the rabbit's behavior, I will tell three main emotions. They are happiness, anger, and scared. Rabbits express themselves through body positions and actions. For happy rabbit, they will be in a low position as the feet being tucked together. Bun is often being keying as they will bounce in the air and twist their bodies as another indication of enjoyment in rabbits whenever they are thrilled. Rabbit can be seen in an angry mood when they show an act of boxing. They will charge at you and possibly bite when you are trying to be handy. An angry rabbit may also growl which usually sounds more like an angry grunt and the position of the ear is held against at the back and the mouth is open to show the teeth. For a scared rabbit, they might hide or sit still while the muscle being tense, their back being flattened and their pupils are dilated. One problem behavior of rabbit is chewing. It is a normal situation for rabbit as their teeth grow continuously. Therefore, it is a must to chew to prevent the teeth from overgrowing. In order to prevent them from harming themselves, provide an environment of rabbit proof. Prepare a wooden toy that is specialized for them to chew and provide enough hay as it helps to wear down the rabbit's teeth. Next, during the handling process, ensure yourself to be caring and loving to them. Be cautioned to their fragile spine as they might hurt them whenever they feel uneasy and starting to struggle. There are two ways to restrain them. One, you may use your bare hand or you can use a towel for the same purpose. By using your hand, it is important to make the rabbit feel secure against the body and that there's something underneath the rabbit to be aware of. So now, you can see that the rabbit feels very relaxed and no stress at all. By using the towel method, you need to place the bunny in the middle of the towel. Take the edge of the towel and tuck it in underneath the chin area and then bring one side of the towel up and over the back and then crisscross that with the other side and that give us a nice secure bunny burrito. The poster provided can explain in detail about our topic today. Feel free to pause this video to read up the material. Thank you for watching.